welcome back to my channel y'all welcome to Mel's Beauty I'm Mel so this was another successful wash week using Diva Curls if you can see my ponytail my puff she she back she puffy and she very moisturized I can look at the oil on my hair as I touch it which is quite a good thing for me so um I tried something different do using diva curls which I know a lot of people will probably do it's probably use other products with they diva curl and I want to see does it this wash I did with diva curls is it good with other products now my beginning of the watch kind of begin to sound try to put a little video up here y'all see me washing my part of my hair as i talk i did use the wash day wonders which i am loving so far i cannot wait to do the final review on this baby right here i i i, I can't wait i i'm loving this wash day wonders like what Deep Curls, what witchcraft did you do to make that? But I can't get too much detail into it because we gotta wait until the end of the month. That's alright, it's like around the corner, so we're gonna get that review soon. <laughs> so I did the pre-treatment of detangling and my hair was so tangled y'all as I was sectioning it off. I was having the most hardest time, but once I put the water in, Put the de put the wash they wonder in those detangles and start oh oh like my hair is still not tangled at all. I'm like I can I can run my hands through my hair. I need to stop because I'm messing with the oil in my hair. <laughs> and this time I didn't use the um build up booster because I didn't really have any build up because I wasn't wearing weave. <laughs> so I used the cleanser shampoo which is a little different the no poof the no poof shampoo is like weird it's weird that it don't lather and you I think coming from people who have used shampoo for so, so long you used to your shampoo lathering but I had to do this and I'm like okay I feel like I just have conditioner in my head but I cleaned my hair twice with the cleanser it was it didn't really strip my hair I didn't feel my hair like too dry and not too moisturized so I was like okay different <laughs> like really different because I try I used to use it as a like a tr a tr mm. I'm beginning time tired let me slow down I used to use the shampoo just for like pre-poofing my hair. I mean not pre-poofing but you know a pre-cleanse. But this time I'm not using it as a pre-cleanse. I'm actually using it as shampoo. It feels different. My hair took it kind of weird. My, uh, when I finished washing it I had a curl. One of my curls was so defined it's like oh yes I like this. Let me curl for you real quick. I was like okay. I see you curl I see you I see you but um I used the conditioner and that's when the other products got placed in there I forgot what I use and I threw it away oh my goodness I bought a little packet and it was conditioner too and I know some people like combining two conditioners into one because I do it a lot because I have one vitamin E oil and something else. Well, not vitamin E. It's vitamin E conditioner and I mix it with something else and my hair felt fabulous. But, um, I got that. It had honey. It was, but no, it was bananas. Yeah, if I tell you when I opened that pack and I smelt it and it smelled just like bananas, I was like, oh my god. This actually smells really good. <laughs> so I put the deep curl conditioner in first. Then I went in with the other conditioner, and I think it was by 
O R S, and it was banana something. It was for dry, dry, brutal, brutal hair. So I said, why not mix them together and see what they do? So I kind of worked it through. I did my detangling. No matter what I do, when I when I condition, I have to detangle. So I detangled. My hair was like curling. Shrinkage was real because my hair ain't really short. It's down here. <laughs> so I detangled. I didn't put a, um, a shower cap on this time. I just let it sit. Uh, I say about 30 minutes. I let it sit in my head. And then when I came back, my hair was just so soft. So I went ahead, rinsed it, rinsed it out. And yeah, my hair was so soft and it was like, this is, this is really good. Like, Deep Curl really play well with other products. And what I used last time to style my hair, I used the same thing. But I greased my scalp, which I didn't do last time. And it came back to haunt me because I didn't grease my scalp. When I um, greased my scalp, I actually used Blue Magic, the original. Not the one in these multicolors, I mean the original, original. Where you can see the little C's and it's white, it's a white top. That's the um, blue magic I use to oil my scalp. Of course I use my main choice growing oil. But I use something different. This one I didn't throw in the trash, it's actually right here. It's called Curls Unleash which have shea butter and honey and it's called curl defining cream which is a moisturizer that helps for less shrinkage and natural hair which i think is kind of doing this job but it's keeping my hair very moisturized and not only that i use my black what is it black oil black castor oil jamaican jamaican black castor oil which I use to seal in the moisture. So I moist I use that moisturizer first. No, I grease my scalp. I put the growing oil in. Then I put the moisturizer in. I worked it through. Then I sealed it with the um, Jamaican black castor oil by mango and lime to seal in my particles. Then I went back in with the what is it called? I'm getting time to tie y'all. It's I'm a little tired. I, I just came home from church. I used the set it the set it free spray again. Well finishing spray, but I went in with the super cream coconut styling styler and with the ultra gel. But I didn't stop at that gel. I also used eco gel. And I use again the Shea Moisture Black, the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Edge Treat Treatner, which is nothing but edge control. But I put that on first, then I put the Eco Gel, and I just started brushing it back so it can do this. <laughs> and as with this. And with the with the um, super cream, when I say it starts stressing stressing my hair, well, loosening up my curls, which this did say is going to make it less shrinkish. Shrinkish? What is shrinkishes? I have no idea. I'm making up words, but um, it made it more easy to style. And I always have a water bottle, and I think y'all probably think it's weird. The reason why I have a spray bottle of water because my hair is more easier to deal with if I have the spray bottle. Oh, and I also use for the first time is the towel, the Diva Curl towel, which I didn't dry my hair all the way. I semi dried it because I want to keep my pores open because I have low porosity hair. So if I keep it wet, pores open, more moisture. Because, uh, when I woke up this morning, my hair still wasn't dry. <laughs> so, I patted it a little bit, which you don't need to pat too much because it starts taking up all the water. But, um, back to styling. I use a 
not a heavy brush but a flat brush to brush everything back I had the eco gel I had the gel definer then I used my string to start going back it's a string I don't use a rubber band I use a string to go all the way back and once I got my string where I wanted to I started wrapping my hair and I went to sleep and this is what I got the next day at church looking fresh my hair was still a little wet this morning I didn't have time to use the hair dryer I can't wait to use this diffuser soon and I do mean soon I'm going to have to use that diffuser soon but I didn't have time so I went with my hair still wet from last night <laughs> it's dry now it's not it's no longer wet but you can see how much my hair stretches. yeah it does that <laughs> it does that but so far we too do it do well with other products yes it does very well with other products so we too uh washing my hair with diva curl is going great i can't wait for week three and week four and i think with week three i'm gonna go ahead and do a hot oil treatment i still have yet to ha get the new leave-in moisturizer for super curly hair like us and so i gotta me gotta wait for my coin to get here to buy <laughs> so hopefully before the end of this month i have that so i can try that out with the rest because i'm going to leave a leave-in okay if i don't i'm going to keep on using different other people leave-ins but hey you never know I, you might need to use a different leave-in whatever leave-in work for you like i said that's why i did it with other products to see if diva curl work well with other products because you never know you it might be a moisturizer you like to use and you're like i ain't into changing my moisturizer i just want to change my shampoo and my conditioner that's fine so far this i say this goes well with other products because my hair is still moisturized it's still oily and probably later on through the week like i did last week i'm gonna to have to use the mr right is to refresh and sting your curls and I probably and I love the way this smell is I, I can't even, it smell like I don't even, I can't even put my my tongue on it what it smell like but it smells like delectable so but we too success so I see y'all beauties in the next video and this I about to say end this been week two and I already said that. Oh, fix it, Jesus. So I'm about to get ready to go to bed. Really, I I'm about to get ready to go to bed. It has been a long day. <laughs> I'll see y'all beauties in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that little notification bell down there. Don't forget my little face gonna be right here video next video gonna be right here go ahead and check out my channel i would love for your feedback comment tell me what you think so far about this diva girls because uh i ain't gonna say too much but she she at the halfway mark i'm, I'm so ready to do this review i'm so ready so we got like two more weeks before you know the final find a verdict on diva curls so see y'all in the next video bye